<laughs> or to, to become a professor, all you need is after your master's. Or maybe you, president. No, you get like, a PhD. Ah, you, you get a PhD. <laughs> you get a PhD. Then, then, then you, 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 I, I need to come and talk to your you high should. commission because <laughs> I. I am here. 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 I am to honor and to graduate Bachelor of Social Work degree. <laughs> Expressing my really deep and very, very um, sincere condolences to the families that we lost eight girls in a dormitory that were locked and they were compl that were completely uh, locked in and they were helpless and died in a very horror, tragic accident. I want to tell all the teachers in this country, education managers, the parents, and all of us, that education is not only academic work or grades. Education is everything about life. So those children, as we go through managing education of our children, we must not only think about how they do well in exams, although that is important, we must also think about how to take care of them. I also want to express my condolences to the families of Tana Delta. Again, th this is really a referendum on the leadership of Kenya. We saw the signs of restlessness in Tana Delta and why the provisional administration and the government didn't take urgent action it's difficult to say, but I hope again that we will meaningfully go and engage and address the issues that are making communities in Tana Delta very restless. We are very happy today here in Lodariak area of Kagado North, where we are celebrating one girl who excelled and managed to get a sponsorship to go to Canada. The Ryerson University in Canada brought her back to the village to come and show the value of education. This is an encouragement that we must give equal opportunities, equal educational opportunities to all children in this country, regardless of their backgrounds. 